when you're uh, going down the road and you're cruising is one thing but when you got it need more power you're going to need a little extra gas and that's where the power circuit comes into play uh, at idle uh, you got the highest vacuum intake vacuum and the intake vacuum goes through here to the power valve and through here and it pulls the uh, get this loose it pulls a power valve closed so it's closed when you're at idle and here's a spring loaded right here you see what happens it closes you see it going up and down so at idle highest vacuum it keeps it closed as you uh, <clears throat> as you increase speed and you will lose manifold vacuum and the spring will cause it to open up fuel will go into here from the float bowl you can see how it fits inside the float bowl right here so fuel will go into there fuel will uh, exit out these little slots on the side and that lines up with these uh, holes right here and you can follow the holes up through the idle there's you got some idle uh, vent tubes here uh, anyway it goes into here and goes into the venturi here and down in the throat okay so that's how that works uh, to test this now you need a vacuum gauge you need to find something uh, that will cover this i don't have anything right off hand but uh uh, if you can find something to cover this, I mean, they do this on machines and apply your uh, uh, vacuum to see if it's open at the right time. That's the only way you can test these things. Okay, uh, you can try blowing through it when it's uh, uh, open. It should you should be able to blow through it a little bit. Doesn't it's not much, by the way. And then when you close it, you shouldn't be able to blow through it. Uh, so <clears throat> one thing to look for when you take this off: look for fuel in here. Okay, there should not be any fuel on this side of it. If there's fuel in there, it's a, the, 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 the thing is blown, replace it. Okay, always replace it when you're building your carburetor. All of our kits that, uh, uh, that need power valves have them included. And uh, let's see, that's about it. So be sure when you're cleaning that you can clean through all these holes here, all these small holes. Some of these, like this one, pulls in air to mix with the gas. You want to be sure all these blow, blow carburetor uh, cleaner through it, through these holes here. And watch it come out the other side. Be sure you wear your goggles, by the way. I've shot it in my eyes before. It hurts. Um, and that's it. And that's how that works. So it should help you out uh, if you want to diagnose any uh, power problems. All right. I appreciate you watching this.